Every now and then, you win a comic that you cannot believe that you won. This is one of those times. So if you want to see what modern book this is, stick around. Go go subscribe to We Love Comics. We love, and we do, we love comics. This video is sponsored by PGX Grading Services. Get one free pressing of your choice when you grade 10 with the code We Love Comics Free Press. Link in description. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Once again, my name is Chris, and this is We Love Comics. And yes, I did say this is a modern age book, but even with that, I cannot believe I won this. Um, whether people think I overpaid, underpaid, whatever, uh, I am thoroughly happy with this book. I think, considering what is involved in this book, uh, I think this is, I don't know, a steal, but definitely something that I am proud to have in my collection. I don't think I've seen anything like this before. So I am so looking forward to this. They wrap this really well, and that is because I always make sure to use proper communication with the sellers. I never assume that a seller either knows what they're doing or cares, because trust me, if they can save money with shipping, they will do it. So never be afraid to ask how you would like it to be shipped, because the worst that will happen is they just won't do it. But you'd be surprised. For every one that won't do it, there'll be 20 that will. So never be afraid to speak up. So this is a modern book, and I cannot wait to show you this. This is one of those when I want it. And there you go, your daily dose of kittens, so kittens in comics. But um, I, like I said, I could not believe I won this book. Now, obviously, I didn't win it for a dollar or anything like that. This is not a cheap books by any means, but considering what is involved with it, which, of course, you will see very shortly, um, I cannot complain. So it looks like it arrived in perfect shape. That is most important. So they did put it in cardboard. They put it in a box, wrapped it very well. So great job to the seller. And uh, this is, of course, Oregon. He always, for some reason, wants to be in these comic book videos. Some of you appreciate that. So... It's always nice to have him make his cat meow appearance. So, let me adjust this camera. And before I show it, don't forget to wait until the end. <clears throat> so you can see who's today's surprise subscriber shout out. And if you want to be one, you just either got to be a cat or you just got to be a subscriber. So, <clears throat> excuse me, just let me know and I will be more than happy to show you. So... Without further ado, and my cat is really excited about this, let me show you the book that I won. So this is, let me move him out of the way so I don't want to overdo it. Spider-Gwen, issue number one. This is from the first series. You know, I think it's on series 12 at this point. But uh, this is the 1 in 100 Adam Hughes variant. Now, as you can see, there's a lot of writing on this. This has the following signatures. It has Adam Hughes' signature and sketch. It has Rico Renzi signature and sketch. Dan Slott. Jason Latour. Robbie Rodriguez. And last but not least, Stan Lee. So, <laughs> this book has six signatures and two sketches on the 1 in 100 variant of Spider-Gwen issue number 1. Now, of course, this isn't her first appearance or anything like that, but still, considering how this character is on the rise, and I have an opinion, in my opinion, it will continue to rise, this book is definitely one to acquire. Now, this book is covered in fur, as you can see, but um, this book, ungraded, I've seen sell for... 300 and up. I've seen just a Stanley signature alone. What is with this cat tonight? A signed book by Stan Lee sell for $600. So this has not only Stan Lee, but five other signatures, including two of the sketches. I didn't pay 600, didn't pay 500, didn't pay 400. With shipping and handling, I won this for $359.50. And that was an auction, not a buy it now. So some people would pay it, some people won't. That's up to you. If this is not your cup of tea, 
that's perfectly fine because it's my cup of tea. And that's one of the things I want to basically just really get to people, especially if you're new to collecting. Collect what you love. Collect what makes you happy. And you will always be enjoying this wonderful hobby of collecting comics. There's so many people out there that'll say, oh, I'd never buy that and make you feel like you did something wrong or think you're crazy. You know what? Like I said, if it makes you happy, it's the right purchase. So for me, whether no one else in the world would do it, I did it. I'm very happy. And uh, this will be a book that will get graded. So I'm very excited. Now, this will not come out a 9.8. I don't know. You tell me. Because there's a little tiny mega bit of color that has been... I don't know if that's actually the tip. You know how sometimes even on a 9.8, they can have that little extension? So I don't know if that's actually the extension and it's folded over a little bit. Or there's a tiny little microscopic piece of a color break. So if that's the case, this would probably get a 9.6. I don't know if a 9.8 would still qualify for that. Because remember, a 10 is perfect. A 9.8 is not a perfect book. So I wonder if that would qualify. Um, I do see a minor, minor little bend right in the corner. But it does not break color. So a pressing would absolutely help this book. And, of course, this is going to have white pages and everything. So just to show you the close-up of the Adam Hughes sketch and the Rico Renzi sketch. Now, some people would say, why would you take the chance with this when it doesn't have a certificate of authenticity? Well, just also keep in mind, anybody can write up a certificate of authenticity. So, I mean, unless it's like PSA uh, DNA, you know, you never know that a certificate is going to guarantee it. But if you do your research and you learn about signatures, you should know what to look for. So I've seen many of these before, especially with Adam Hughes, uh, Hughes' sketches. They pretty much, almost all of them end up being like that. So you just make sure you do your research. So I was lucky enough to get not only filled with all these signatures goodness, but also it included Stan Lee. So that is the icing on the cake. So that is the book. So thank you very much. If you like this kind of stuff, please give it a thumbs up because I always appreciate the support. Share it if you are oh so kind to do so. Hit subscribe if you haven't. Just don't hit the person next to you because we know that's just not nice. Don't forget to wait in the end to see who's today's surprise, subscri surprise subscriber shout out. See, I get too excited sometimes. And don't forget, it's not you, it's not I, it's We Love Comics. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you next video. And is it me, or does it look like she's not sitting on anything? She's a superhero. Thank you for watching my video. If you want to connect with me on Facebook, just click right here. If you want to join our cashback program and get $10 off your first purchase of $25 or more, click here. And then if you aren't subscribed, we'd love you to join by clicking here.